guys and welcome back to my Halloween Spooktacular. We're uploading a new video every single day of the week before Halloween. So today's Halloween tutorial, I'm making myself look like a purple widow slash spider queen, whatever you want to use this for. So anyway, if you want to learn how to get this look, keep on watching. Going straight into the eyes, I am priming them with the NYX eyeshadow pencil and milk and then I'm just going to set that with a white eyeshadow. I'm then going into Bling Boss from the Jaclyn Hill Vault Collection and taking Hush on a fluffy brush. I'm applying that into our crease as a transition shade and winging it out for a cat eye effect. Then going in with Purple Panic from Coastal Scents. This is one of their Hot Pot Single Shadows. I'm going in with the same fluffy brush as earlier and applying that all over the lid into the crease and winging it out to keep that cat eye shape. Going back into the Bling Gloss palette, I'm taking Mystic on a fluffier pencil brush and I'm applying this only to the outer corner, continuing to wing it out. I'm then going in with Sinister from Lexi Beauty and I'm applying this to the inner and outer corner, still winging it out to give a faux halo eye effect. I'm then just blending out the edges and taking the Single Shadow Foxy from Urban Decay, I'm going to use that to highlight my brow bone. I'm then going back into the Bling Boss palette and taking Ballsy on my finger. I'm applying that to the middle of the lid to give that halo effect. And then I'm just going to blend out the edges so it blends in with the rest of our eye. And then wipe away all of the loose powder on our face. Then going to my lower lash line, I'm just taking the same eyeshadows that I used for our lid. And I am doing a halo on the lower lash line as well. I'm then applying some liquid eyeliner and I am making a cat eye for this look. The eyeshadow look, since it's a cat eye, will really help us make our cat eye liner. You can totally make this as thick, thin, tiny, big as you want. Do whatever you want. I'm now just taking some black gel liner and applying it to my tight line and waterline. Then taking Purple Horseshoe from the Moonchild Glow Kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I'm applying that to my inner corner as well as to where we apply the lighter shade for our halo eye. And then I'm just applying some mascara to the bottom and lower lashes. Okay, so now we're going into the crown spider web. So I am first drawing a line in the middle of my forehead, then I'm curving it towards my temples, and then drawing one in the middle and repeating that on the same sides before doing the little curved lines for the spider web effect. One, two, one, two, And then after doing the inner part of the spider web, I'm going to thicken the curved lines a little bit so it looks kind of like a tiara. 2000 years later. Okay, so now that it is done and where we want to be, we are now going to draw our spider. I'm first drawing a circle and then filling it in with the liner using the end of a brush. I would suggest doing this whole crown and spider drawing out part with gel liner because it's a lot more forgiving and easier to control. I'm now just going in with some concealer to kind of give an hourglass shape so that way it looks kind of like a spider because I'm so scared of spiders and I really didn't want to have to look up a picture of one. I'm now just using the liquid eyeliner to sharpen up the lines and then I am going to be drawing the legs. I'm now just taking some purple liquid lipstick and I'm making the Black Widow spider sign for my spider. I'm then just going to highlight my face with purple horseshoe again from the Moonchild Glow Kit. 
For my lips, I'm doing an ombre lip, so taking the black and purple mixed together, that's gonna be my overall base shade. Then taking just the purple lipstick by itself, I'm gonna apply that into the middle, so that way it can fade easily into the lightest purple that we are applying to the middle of the lip. And lastly, I'm just gonna apply some false eyelashes. These lashes are from Kiss Lashes, and these are from their Easy Lash line in the style Flirty. I hope you guys like this tutorial. If you haven't seen my previous videos already, the playlist will be linked in the description box below. I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you in tomorrow's Halloween tutorial. Bye!